Hello friends, in this video we will discuss that how to draw isometric view of square base pyramid. Square base pyramid having base edge 50 and height 60. All the dimensions are in millimeter. So base edge is 50 and height is 60. So let's draw the base of the object first. So let's draw one reference line here. Horizontal reference line. Select a pole point. Let's say this is a pole point. Align your protector here with pole point and reference line. This is very first step. Here it will take some time to align it. Now measure the angle of 30 degree. 0, 10, 20, 30. Similarly from this side. 0, 10, 20 and 30. Both the sides we have to measure the angle of 30 degree. So from this pole point. You have to draw a line. This should be a thin line here also draw a continuous thin line now the base edge is 50 mm so first we have to draw a frame of 50 by 50 I mean all the dimensions should be 50 mm so take a compass of 50 mm From this scale you can measure 50. So now from this pole point this side we need 50 this side also we need 50 now from this point this direction in this direction we need 50 to so take an arc of 50 from here also we need 50 So now you can join these points until or unless the object is not confirmed we will not convert it into thick line once the object is confirmed then we'll convert this in thick line so now this is the base of the object you can remove this remaining line. This is the base of the object. Square base which is prepared like a rhombus. Now we will find out the midpoint of the lines. The base of the object is ready. Now we have to construct the height of the object. Height is 60. So we will take the height from the center. So let's mark the centroid of the object. This is 50, so half of the dimension is 25, this is 0, 10, 20 and 5 mm, 25. So you can copy this value with the help of compass, this is 25 this side and 25 this side. Similarly from here, 25 this side and 25 this side simply we have marked the midpoint of all the four base edges here we will draw the center line to mark the centroid of the object so we will use the chain type line here we will not join it diagonally because the diagonal is not a correct representation of the centroid we have to mark the axis of symmetry to show the centroid of the object now this is the centroid so from this centroid we will take the height of 60 
दिस शुड बी एग्जैक्टली वर्टिकल लाइन जस्ट अलाइन यूर स्केल विद द हेल्प ऑफ डॉट्स यूर ऑल्सो विल ड्रॉ दी सेंटर लाइन तो दिस इज द एपेक्स ऑफ द पिरामिड now we'll join this apex with all these vertices you can see now this is the height of the pyramid so let's join this apex with these four vertices so here you can use the thick line you have to join this apex with this vertex also we have to join these base edge also basically we have to convert visible outlines in the thick line continuous thick line this is the hidden edge of the object so we'll keep it as a construction line there is no need to convert it in hidden line because in isometric views we are not showing hidden lines so we will keep this line just for the construction so this is the square base pyramid let's see the dimensions how to write the dimensioning of this object for dimensioning we'll use the same logic here 30 degree lines place your scale here the object line is at 30 degree so extension line should be also at 30 degree now this is the dimension line check the position of the scale this scale is parallel to this base edge means dimension line should be also at 30 degree even this line of the arrowhead should be at 30 degree so here we can write sq 50 mean square 50 let's write the height so in case of height you have to take the extension line from the centroid now here also you have to draw a line at 30 degree but one trick is there let's draw one vertical line here exactly vertical line this is dimension line now you can join the apex with the end point of dimension line now this line will be at 30 degree it will be just like a parallelogram draw this line take height and join the end points so this height is 60 here you can follow unidirectional style also so i am following a line style here so this is the isometric view of a square base pyramid if you want